Hello. In the second term, we will learn about the main characters of living organisms and living organisms' body systems. Okay. Let's start to learn with each other the main characters of living organisms. Living organisms have common characteristics such as nutrition, growth, transportation, respiration, sensation, reproduction, secretion, and motion. We have eight characters. We have what? Eight characters. Again, nutrition, growth, transportation, respiration, sensation, reproduction, excretion, and motion. That's the main characters of any living organisms. Okay. Living organisms body consists of number of systems. That we can say that our body consists of a number of systems. Each system consists of a group of organs. Okay, let's take some examples of our body systems. Digestive system, respiratory system, circulatory system, urinary system, nervous system, reproductive system. Okay, number one, digestive system. We will uh, learn with each other about the function, about the function of each system. Okay, digestive system function, digestion and absorption of food, absorption of food, digestion and absorption of food. Okay, number two, respiratory system respiration to produce energy to the body okay number three circulatory system distributing digested food and oxygen to all body cells number four urinary system cleaning the body from harmful wastes Cleaning the body from harmful wastes. Nervous system responsible for sensation, hearing, vision, smell and taste. Responsible for sensation, hearing, vision, smell and taste. Reproductive system reproducing new individuals of the same kind. Again, we can say some examples of our body systems again. Digestive system, respiratory system, circulatory system, urinary system, nervous system, reproductive system. Let's take